Oh, hello guys, how the frig's it going, eh? So I just got my ass out of bed because, uh, well, I don't know why. There's not much I can really do today. Everything's closed due to being Good Friday, and yeah, I got nothing to do today. <laughs> but I do have coffee to make today, because I love coffee. So I got up today, came downstairs, went to go let the dog out, when I realized there was a pa uh, package. There was a bag over in the other room. A bag of what? Okay, so last time I was at the grocery store, I bought Oreo. A bag of cookies. Uh, pepperonis, if you will. Probably heard of pepperonis. Basically, they're full size pepperettes for dogs. Well, this is the thing. I know he wasn't the only culprit. I know Scampers got involved in this because Oreo couldn't have reached where the pepperonis were. And I'll show you that. I'm just filling up my water jug. But uh, I had the bag of pepperonis up here pushed in, like pushed in back there beyond those scoops. And they weren't there. Somebody helped Oreo get them down because somebody wanted, like, she's such a pig. She's, I'm, I'm just going to have to not bother with the hopper system, realize that she's inbred as fuck already, and that, uh, <coughs> just overfeed her because all she wants to do is eat, and when she can't eat, she gets destructive and starts breaking my shit. Yeah, like, I had them in there. Somebody pulled them down, and then over here this morning, I found an empty bag of pepperonis. There's literally two missing out of it. I don't know how many pepperonis are in a bag. Maybe 24, maybe 30. All I know is it clearly says on the box, for a dog Oreo size, one to two a day. <laughs> and he ate the whole freaking bag. I highly doubt the cat ate any. Maybe the cat, well, maybe, maybe the cat thinks that's a tasty treat. I, I don't know. I don't know. One thing I do know is he didn't shit the carpet, which means good. And chances are this might have happened before I, um, or not too before I got up or something like that. I can't even speak English right now. I need my coffee. This is ridiculous. But I fed both the cat and the dog, and the cat won't leave her food bowl alone. She's going to empty that out right away. Then she's going to sit there and meow at me for a half an hour. And then she's going to get destructive again. Freaking cat, I tell you. But um, Oreo, however, you know, he, he's over there. He's sitting in the living room playing with his fox or whatever. I filled his dish. He hasn't even touched it. He doesn't even care about it because he's all loaded up on cookies right now. But this thing... Fucking Captain Destructor Pants. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Remember when you're getting your kitties to make sure that their parents weren't siblings, people. Otherwise, problems arise. Well, I haven't been doing too much today, people. I'm going to be friggin' honest with you. I lied. I just made seven episodes of Stardew Valley for Escaping Games. So, scores. Uh, those are being edited right now. There's really not much to do. I gotta go out and get cat food for scampers, but everything's closed, so we're gonna have to do that tomorrow. Not a big deal, not a big deal indeed. Uh, what else is there? What else is there? Really not much going on. In like, what, T minus three days? We got Trailer Park Boys Season 10 on the Netflix. Looking forward to that. That's kind of exciting. I do say so myself. And I got a water droplet right here on the camera. I gotta clean my lens. <laughs> I think I made things worse. Pretty sure I made things worse. One second. It's really hard to clean the lens on this camera because the stupid thing moves around, but I think I got it. That looks a lot better. Probably. I hope so. Got all the videos edited. They're all uploaded to YouTube. We are golden. So they're all up on Skaven Games. So if you're enjoying that Stardew Valley, by all means, check it out on Skaven Games. Now, here's something I want to mention is when I played the single player before just soloing and rushing through things, I didn't unlock half as much as I have playing it now. Like, I've been unlocking things. I got this awesome ring now that glows in the dark. That's pretty sweet. I got all sorts of cool stuff going on that um, it's really made this experience in Stardew Valley so much better and easier. Except for all the money I had on my previous save, but eh, we don't need to worry about that. So I'm going to go let the scruffy, fluffy puppy whoopie outside for a poopy. For a poopy time. You want to go poopy time, puppy? Let's go see if he actually ate any food, because he ate all those treats. And he dropped a squirrely outside. You know what? Look at this. He's barely even touched his food. Because he's got an upset tummy, because somebody went and ate all of his cookies already. Now he's got no cookies to eat. Like, literally, I got no cookies for him anymore. He ate them all. So when it comes to treat time, the cat will get hers, and he already had all his. Yeah, you did. You ate all your treats, buddy. You're not supposed to do that. You're supposed to pace yourself. But, uh, we'll let him out. 
Freaking end of the driveway is just... Ah, I should be able to clear that one. I was gonna go out and shovel the driveway, but it's like, you know what? It's plus two Celsius out today. It's gonna be... It's gonna be like a lot Celsius out tomorrow. And Sunday it's gonna be rainy with plus six. So... Hey Oreo! Hey! Hey! We don't eat our poop! Come on! Uh, he's gonna crap right on his leash. Look at him. He's gonna crap right on his leash. Right on his freaking leash. Lovely. But yeah, it's, it's gonna be sunny, uh, not sunny, but it's gonna be raining on Sunday with plus six degrees. So it's like, this snow ain't gonna last. Why burn myself out shoveling it? Doesn't make sense, right? So, I guess we'll just wait and see what actually happens with the snow, and then we'll hammer down. So. Well, that's super, super duper right there. Holy crap, puppy's totally squatting one off. He's like looking at me like, don't film this, I'm pooping. He's like totally stegosaurus up too. Like perfect form, feet touching each other, just squatting a duke. But he's not pooping. He must be right bunged up from eating all those cookies. Oh, I wish I had some of the good, good whole wheat shreddies. I'd feed him those. That'll give him the runs. That'll make him poop out hard. That's what happens when you eat a bag of pepperonis. Cause like, do I have anything? up here that's comparison to the bag no i don't well i've got this old thing of green like picture a bag this size which is the size of my head okay this is greenies for his teeth so he does have some cookies left just not a lot what the heck is this oh and he's got these too so he does have some cookies left a picture a bag the size of that greenies full of pepperonis there's probably like 50 or 60 of them in there and they gone he ate all of them gone he's really not hungry today but he is holding that stegosaurus pose the whole time I've been vlogging, and he hasn't pooped yet. He has this concerned look on his face. Can we get it in the shot? He has this really concerned look on his face like, oh, this hurts so much right now. I'm pooping, but it's not coming out. The poop is bigger than the hole. Hey, the poop is bigger than the hole, buddy. Aw, oh, freak's sake. That'll learn you. That'll learn you to let the cat get your treats down and eat them all in one sitting. Eh? So you don't eat all your treats in one sitting. That's why you don't just have dessert for breakfast and lunch and supper. Because you'll get the shits. Uh, hopefully he's good and I don't have to bring him to the vet and be like, Yeah, he ate a bag of pepperonis. Because the cat's a dick. <laughs> uh, the Adventures of Oreo and Scampers. And I wish I would have caught that on film when it happened, but the problem is, is this camera here doesn't have a wide enough angle view to uh, capture this podium there. I'm just lucky she didn't get up here and grab this brand new bag of uh, cat treats because that would have been a bad time. Is that him? He's back. Did you have a good poopy? He literally didn't do any damage. How's the constipated life, bud? How's that treating you? Should I expect a great big pile of dog shit on my carpet tonight? Probably should. But anyway, it's 8.30 at night and all I've been doing today is, like I said, I was playing that game and then uh, I uploaded it. I think for supper tonight, I'm going to keep it simple. I'm just going to have some pizza pockets or something simple. 9 o'clock, we're thinking about teaming up. We're going to play uh, The Forest. Yeah, a different type of game for, uh, for, for the channel. Because uh, I used to play it back in the day on Skaven Games, but we quit for a while. And there's been a lot of improvements. Apparently now, with the, uh, on the island you crash on, apparently you can befriend the natives. That's different. I don't know if we're going to be able to do that, because apparently there's a lot of complicated shit in getting the natives to be your friends. It's a lot easier to put your axe through their forehead. But I guess we'll have to wait and see. See what we can do. See what kind of pros we have. It's going to be me, Don2323. I think I got that right. And uh, Jane's going to be there. You've probably seen her or heard of her from Adrian on Adrian's uh, on Tasty Glue channel. And we're also going to uh, be playing with another guy I never met before. His name's Ryan. Not sure who that is, but that's what we're going to do tonight. So I'm just going to ram off some pizza pops and go see if we can get organized for the forest. Oh yes, cook my little pretties, cook. So I finally figured out, after watching uh, Swearing It today, they released the Green Band trailer for Trailer Park Boys Season 10. And I now understand how Snoop Dogg fits into the picture. So on this trailer, if you haven't seen it because you're not subscribed to Swearnet or whatever reason, uh, they basically talk about the state of the trailer park. They've opened up like a casino, a strip club, uh, and a medicinal dispensary that is illegal as frig. 
So, obviously Ricky's running that show, right? Yeah, we all know that. Anyway, so Snoop Dogg, by the looks of it, comes to the park to try out the dope. That's how Snoop Dogg gets put into this picture. So, that makes a lot of sense. I'm anxious for next Monday for that to come out. It's going to be a great show. And, uh, me and this thing are going to be sitting right here on this couch watching it from that old Dell computer on this 55 inch TV. It's going to be fun, right? Buddy, can you jump? He's not jumping. He is genuinely ill. Are you okay? Can you jump? Up. Wow, you're really not feeling good, are you? How's your tummy? Oh, you got a fast heart rate. I don't know if that's normal. You're little, so it's probably normal, right? You probably should have a fast heart rate because you're tiny. Hey, buddy, get down. Get down. <laughs> you're genuinely sick. Because you ate all those cookies that you weren't supposed to eat. And it's all your fault that you knocked them down. Why would you do this to him? Why are you trying to kill my puppy? She's out of food and she's just waiting for more. You got a couple pieces in there. You're not getting any till like a while. <clears throat> oh. Got some wet food for her, but. She ain't getting that till a little bit later. Like I literally fed her at four. And it's only been four hours, so. Mm. Supposed to be a half a cup of food every uh, every day for her. So the dietitianary veterinarian told me, half a cup of food, Jesus Murphy. It's not a lot of food, but it's okay. At least she's not. I haven't seen her barf anywhere in a while, so obviously the vets know something I don't know. So that's perfect. But anyway, pizza pockets are done. Oh, you only beat four times. Yeah. These are not authentic. They're totally no name. They taste okay. They're aight. They ain't tight. They're just aight. Okay, so we just got done doing the friggin' stream. And this lens is filthy again, for frig's sakes. Anyway, we just got done doing the stream, and it was brutal. It was literally brutal. Um, started off not too bad. We're building a base. We went hunting, got katanas, and all sorts of cool weapons and shit. And then the cannibals showed up. So we killed them. Then Don showed me how you can like hang their legs and arms and heads from a rack and eat them. So then we became the cannibals, if you will. That was, that, that happened. And then shortly after, more and more cannibals, more and more cannibals, more and more cannibals. Then we got overwhelmed. Like mega overwhelmed. There was tons of freaking cannibals there. It was brutal. So we dealt with them how we normally do. Flaming axes and katanas. I died a bunch of times. They died a bunch of times. One guy was screaming, get off my land. We made a wall around our base. We called it the Trump wall. Hilarity reasons. It was a pretty good time. I gotta show you this. I'm trying to attach Oreo's thing on his face. <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> He's got his face. He's like, I don't know about this right now. Are you hooked on? Is that through your collar or through your fur? It's through your collar, okay. <laughs> oh, I sneeze, bud. Right. Go run, be free. So we'll let him do his potty break. We gotta feed the kitty. And I gotta rock a piss. Oh, that was good. I don't know if he wants back inside. Come on, dude. Come on. Good boy. He's really, uh, <laughs> friend up since he ate all of that. So he doesn't tear off like he normally does. He's all bleh because he ate the friggin' all the cookies, eh? Friggin' Oreo. If you ate all the cookies. What's the matter with you? Oh, I better feed the cat. Like, he hasn't even touched his food at all. Look at that. Well, you can't really see because of the light, but it's still full. Her, however, Captain Piglet Face. She destroyed her, so I'm going to give her a, a wet food for now. Like I said, tomorrow we got to go get her more food because she's freshly out. So I only got tomorrow. That's it. To go pick up shit for groceries. Because I'm thinking Sunday everything's going to be closed because it's Easter. And I don't know what they do for Easter Monday. I remember when I had my job, we got paid overtime for Good Friday. We got paid overtime for Easter Sunday. And we got paid overtime for Easter Monday. Because the place was supposed to be closed and nobody was working except for operations. So I can't remember if Monday, if anything's open or not. But I'm not going to risk it. I'm going to go out tomorrow. We're going to pick up all the cat food and get some other shite and go from there and yeah that about sums that up 
Not really much else going on tonight. I can't wait for this weather to be gone because like I said before, I want to do a yard sale. Gather up a bunch of shit, load it in the garage and get it ready for sale. And gather up a bunch of shit and put it in the garage and get it ready for the dump. But instead of doing the dump, I'm just going to do what Dad does and that's bag a bunch of garbage that I don't need and put it on the side of the road. You're allowed three bags a week, so slowly but surely get rid of shit. And that's what I have been doing. I've been getting rid of a lot of garbage. There's a lot more I want to get rid of. So right now I'm just cooking up some corn dogs. It's currently one o'clock in the morning. And yeah, it doesn't feel like a productive day, but it was not too bad. You know, we did, I did a lot of stuff that I wanted to do. Made some more copies of, or made some more games, plays of Stardew Valley. Did a live stream tonight of a different game for a change. And uh, yeah, all in all, it was good. It's kind of cool because some of the guys I was chatting with in the game, they play Ark Survival. So maybe, just maybe, we might be able to get an Ark Survival stream going some night. <laughs> Gross. But um, that'd be kind of cool, probably. That'd be kind of cool. So here's hoping, because Ark Survival is a fun freaking game. And I think if a bunch of us tried it, we'd probably have a great time dying. And that would make for an epic stream. Oh, look at her. She's like face down in her bowl, just. Here's all good food. Hey, scammers. 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 That good food? Can I have some? Um, 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 um. She's getting like right irritated. <laughs> oh, she's such a little butt waffle. We got 23 seconds, 22, 21, 20, 19, mother freaking 18, 17, 16, 14, 13, 12, 11 left. So it'll be 9, then 8, then 7, 6, 5. Four, and then three, and then two, and then one, and then the beeps of the doneness of the microwave is done. It's time to get the num noms and eat them up, yum. I really don't know what comes over me sometimes. I don't know. I guess you can call this my supper. I'm gonna go upstairs. I got some YouTubes I wanna watch. And then I will talk to you guys in a bit. Anyway, people. It's um, pretty late at night, so I'm gonna probably call her quits on the vlogging and carry on tomorrow. What are we gonna do tomorrow? Gotta go shopping. Said that about 50,000 times in this vlog. Yeah, I did. Yeah, I freaking did. Yeah, I freaking did. Remember when I looked like that? Not so much anymore. Gotta look professional to try and get a job. Anyway, people, thanks for watching. Like, favorite, and comment as always. And until next time, people, keep on vlogging. Nah.